To begin, we just position the pieces the way that we want them to go together with the edge of the eye cord covering the edge of the shoulder and running along the sides of the neckline. The rest is covered by the eye cord with buttons. So to put the eye cord with buttons in, uh, basically you line up the two edges of the shoulder, the right shoulder, and then you pull the loop through as close to the edge as possible. It doesn't have to be through an eyelet of the lace pattern, but it helps. And then you just button the button. And you can see how it attaches this, the two pieces this way. And then wherever the buttons hit, you just attach it the same way here and here. So for the remainder of the neckline, we use the eye cord with just loops. So you can see I have a tapestry needle on one end. So to start, you start with the loop end of the eye cord, and you just pull it through the very left hand side of the shoulder of each piece. Again, you don't have to use it, the eyelet in the lace pattern, even though eventually they'll probably line up and it'll make it easier. So once you have that loop, you just use the tapestry needle, pull it through. It does help to to pull the loop up um, so that all the other loops of the eye cord won't get stuck. Um, so once you do that, you can just pull it tight on the edge. And then wherever the next loop hits along the side of these two pieces is where you pull it through the lace pattern again. This time it's through the eyelets, which you can see is much easier. So then you just pull it through again with a tapestry needle, like we did before. And you would just continue doing this all along the neckline, attaching it in the way that you prefer. So you can see that it creates an eye cord sort of edge sitting on top of the two cast on seams with little loops that attach both of them here and then on the edge. And that's all.